എല്ലാവർക്കും നമസ്കാരം ഞാൻ വളരെ എക്സൈറ്റഡ് ആയിട്ട് ഇരിക്കുകയാണ് സത്യം പറയാലോ എന്റെ ബി പി ഒക്കെ കൂടി കൂടി എവിടെ എത്തിയിട്ടുണ്ട് സോ ലെറ്റ് മീ സ്റ്റാർട്ട് വിത്ത് മാസ്റ്റർ ബ്രെയിൻ ഓവർ ഹിയർ രാജ്മോലി സർ കേരള ലവ്സ് യു പീപ്പിൾ ഓവർ ദർ അഡോ യു ആൻഡ് വി വാച്ച് യുവർ ഫിലിം ഫസ്റ്റ് ഡേ ഫസ്റ്റ് ഡേ മോർണിംഗ് ഷോ ഫൈവ് തേർട്ടി ഷോ ആൻഡ് ഓൾ വി ഗോ ആൻഡ് വാച്ച് ബിക്കോസ് ദാറ്റ്സ് എ കൈൻഡ് ഓഫ് എക്സെപ്റ്റൻസ് യു റിസീവ് ഫ്രം ആർ ഓഡിയൻസ് ആൻഡ് ഐ ജസ്റ്റ് വൺ ആസ്ക് യു യു ആർ നോട്ട് ലിമിറ്റഡ് ടു തെലുഗു എനി മോർ യു ആർ എ pan india famous uh, person and you cater to audience worldwide and as you know uh, india is not like we have cultural diversity even in case of from kerala like there is a lot of difference yeah. how do you manage to uh, connect with audience across the globe the same way like it's like everybody understands your film whether it's the story or the emotion or the values even the food <laughs> how do you do that no uh, see culturally we might be different we might be speaking different languages uh, the way we behave for different instances might be different but what we feel is the same our emotions are the same as this is the beings. answer i knew he would say because you are an emotional person uh, thank you so much for that answer is there anything else that you think about or do you consciously put some element of commonness when you try to write something no the, the commonness is the story itself when i'm making the story i uh, i i don't put a conscious effort but uh, unconsciously i'll be making stories which are like universal in, yes. in nature universal in nature uh, yeah so at the end of it if i look at my story and say is this a universal kind of story then i try to make it commercially a, a, a pan indian film or catering to the indians all across the globe that kind if i find a Uh, like, like a Maria Dramana Dramana kind of film, then I'll make it only in thing. Okay. Okay. So 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 now uh, that's how you you choose. So you decide which one is is supposed to be parent here, so you decide. So next question is, um, like he said, uh, the strength of his film is the strength of the heroes, the emotional strength. They may not have necessarily superpowers that that is like unusual, but the heroes have a superpower of emotional strength. And uh, when he called you for this film, how did you guys feel? Like, okay, you both are going to turn into superheroes uh things that you can't do in real life you're going to explore in in front of the camera and it's gonna, you're going to watch that on big screen how did you feel <laughs> <laughs> i mean see it's it's not about feeling this you know this 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 feeling of being a superhero i think the fact is as an actor you're very excited you're like in a candy shop yeah when you when you're working with Rajmauli That's a lot of truth Yeah you you're like a child in a candy shop You're going to get pampered Yeah there's so much Yeah pampered no, I mean, no. <laughs> <laughs> So that's that's the no, You're never pampered Yeah but you at least are like a kid in a candy shop where you can grab there's so much for you to grab there's so much does for you to Does he let you grab everything you he want He does yeah see that's what he wants his actors to do He wants his actors he wants his technicians to grab as much as possible you know because he's giving you so much and he wants you to grab everything and give him that much in return also awesome. that's what an actor is more excited about okay. more than okay now you're uh dealing you know like working with the director post bahubali you know it was never like that nothing has changed in rajmouli since our first film together that's another question i've written please don't ruin that <laughs> yeah <laughs> i've like planned the question about it i'll ask you and what about you sir like how did I you i think feel? the thirst for an actor uh is really satisfied when you work with him and that's what i look forward when i'm uh, entering his sets and he challenges you not pampers you he <laughs> challenges you he stimula- uh, uh, stimulates the the thirst of an actor and in every aspect as in action dance even in dance he literally doesn't yeah. show us but he would have uh, really done his homework yeah i tried the natu natu step like i just can't get it just can't get it yeah like how do you guys do it's not no it's not yeah. such a difficult step Like but you should you actually try to do it with somebody and that's when it tends to become difficult it, i just can't get it right take sir. a promise how long did you guys take to uh, learn that step because the whole nation is like the world wide reels instagram wherever you open everyone's doing this step um and most of them are getting it right some are not but they're still acting as if they're getting it right yeah. and uh, it's all about that trend you know yeah. and uh, how did you how long did you take to get that step right it didn't take long we both learned step it instantly as I, as i told you you know before that the step itself is very easy but what's actually tough is the coordination the which expression. he wants which he actually wanted from the song he wanted two people of two different heads two different minds two different body structures two different mentalities to become one yeah but you're actually two different people but you're one it's it's like one body 
what if there's a human being with four legs and four arms right so everything moves in a coordination it's like their mind is one that's where the challenge is. yes so that's where the challenge is and 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 i don't know it was it just it just went viral yeah without even pushing it it was so organic yes you know like rajmouli mentioned it he was like you know there a mother with a son or a daughter a father with a son and a daughter two you know two brothers a brother and a sister a husband and a wife there's so many people and there's there no were, limit to i saw a, a group of people like so many people together they they co and there were people who actually really 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 excelled it like with perfect sync and all so the step as it is is not very tough but it's the sync which we 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 had to get that was that really killed us so both of them are very energetic like on the interviews i could see them like being like children they so so unruly sometimes how did you handle them on the set like was it easy or was it did you have to get a he's good with children vatti edikendi vandutundo you know when when they uh, when they're in the mood to uh, act and perform they're very good students no that you don't need to tell them what to do and they're in that in that phase and suddenly it goes off and they become like not even just school children they'll become like kindergarten kids you know so how do you control kindergarten kids you can't control them you just have to wait for that for that phase to go away and that's, <laughs> yeah, that's it so both of you have worked with him before um i just wanted this is what i wanted to ask you uh, this question is for both of you ram sir like how was it to work with him in the past and uh, how is he as a director now like what has changed or has it anything changed at all i think everything became 10x <laughs> <laughs> uh, his thought process the horizon he's now uh, uh, set for everyone is uh, way bigger mm-hmm. way deeper in okay. terms of writing it's way deeper i've been really have a long time i've seen all his films i think i've enjoyed and i'm sure i will also s- enjoy seeing the the depth of writing which we have enacted for was uh, was was something to it's a treat for the audience it was a treat for us when we were working yeah. it's a treat for the audience the Thank writing you. yes of course sir uh, film will have 10000 people in one frame thousands of people like and uh, yeah everything you'll have the yes. the background everything but this is this script is something which i'm really looking forward to seeing on big screen me too all of yeah. us are <laughs> we are ready we are like brace yourself What about you? Why did you nudge him right now? He nudged me when you were talking. Oh, what the hell? I swear he nudged me when you were talking. You, you saw, saw what you did. I, right? I, I'm seeing everything. Huh? Like, <laughs> so about you, what has changed? Yeah, yeah as as Charan said, I would like cut, copy, paste everything he said. Just would like to add that he's bigger, hungrier, thirstier, and <laughs> and even madder than Because what he was. One of the best we have in India, and. Yes. Uh, I think um, and I think South, he has to be that yes too. as south indians we feel so proud when our movie releases and uh, it's like it's a statement made and uh, it's like we fit in and not just fit in we are at par or maybe better and um, even bollywood celebrates our films right so that's that's a huge achievement and we cannot talk about rrr without mentioning bahubali and the great success that it achieved um the kind of benchmark that it has set has it ever made you feel a little vulnerable or a little nervous um, because thinking about the kind of expectation that people have uh, how do you feel no uh, i have this habit of just uh, letting Detached. go of the previous letting film the, yeah. uh, of course the the memories stay with me but uh, rest everything i just let it go whatever experiences that i had whatever the lessons that i learned from the film the memories will be with me then i let go of the film and work on the new film so uh, this uh, this is like rrr is my, is my first okay okay as a director you create a visual treat for people right like um, i remember going for bahubali uh, so i had a shoot right so we went with this huge group priya ji priya mani she was there with us and um, all of us were there together prasanna master was there so we all bought popcorns and by the end of the film the popcorn is still there we forgot to eat it <laughs> that's how engrossed you <laughs> are and the next thing we were saying is we should watch this in another uh, another language because i want to watch it again because every free frame was so so beautiful i want to stop it 
see every detail and then forward, you know. That's why people are addicted to his films. I feel there's so much of detailing going in and um, it's just crazy how you do, do it. And you are an amazing storyteller. So my question is, where did you realize that you were going to uh, get into this industry and start entertaining millions of people. Did you know this would happen or did it just happen? No, I, I, mean, I was a storyteller from right, my, right from my childhood. Since you were a boy? Yeah, very, very young. In the second class or third class itself, I used to tell stories. So and when you used to bunk class, class, did you ever tell a story to, 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 to my teacher? classmates, to my <laughs> classmates. Uh, then uh, I never realized I'd become a director then because my family is into films. Uh, naturally, my, my journey went towards films and one by one uh, happened. He's very simple. <laughs> so he's a very simple guy. What do you have to say about him as a director? As a director, the, the first question we answered, I think uh, he's... Uh, Is he always like this? Like this like simple? He's very calm and... Yeah, I think uh, he speaks less. But uh, he delivers more, he makes us also deliver <laughs> the same. <laughs> the three of you are extremely popular. Like, it's not easy for you to just step out and have Pani Puri. Or it's not easy to just step out and go watch a film like normal people. So what I'm going to do is give you an Im imaginary uh, opportunity to be invisible for a day. So what would you do? What is the first thing you would do if you were invisible? In? Uh, invisible. 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 Like, invisible. 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 I mean, my answer would be completely different from them because, yeah. uh, because, because I, I don't He lives a very normal life. He has no problems going into theatres, eating Pani Puri Pani Bandi. Bandi. I, do, does everything. I do that every day. What yeah. nobody yeah. knows is every film that releases in a year, 85% he's there with his Watching full family, 25, 30 of them, every single uh, first day first show. First day first show. So this question is irrelevant to Completely him. irrelevant. So he's it's already invisible. Only. It's a <laughs> cultural <laughs> activity for him. <laughs> yeah, yeah, correct. <laughs> That's the right. kind of people they are. Yeah, it's, for, it's that, the question is for them. It's very loud, like the way you speak. Very loud. I, I should be no, I should be <laughs> muted and invisible. <laughs> <laughs> okay. If given a choice. Yeah. I'm invisible. Someone wants to go first. Okay, imagine both yeah. of you are invisible together. I would like to do this to him. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy, no? Like who's pitching me out of the blue? Nobody will know. <laughs> Tarek, I should, I think you should do that. I, same thing to him. No, no, no. I no, actually no, did it. I told you. He just got this opportunity now. Field. But yeah, if you were invisible and muted, I would really want to go visit my favorite restaurant, sit, yeah. eat, 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 eat. Just and not be and judged eat. while <laughs> eating. <laughs> how you are eating? Yeah, how, who is eating? How much? How much? Yeah. So there's just katoris there, yeah. full of food, and someone's just eating it, like full on. So when you look at it, it's just food going through something. Yeah, yeah. 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 Food not in the trailer, we could see uh, both of them riding, one riding a horse, yeah, the riding a bike. I want to know which one was uh, faster, which was uh, more powerful, horse power or horse? How did you match, match with the speed of the horse? Or Technically, I don't know <laughs> who will win at the end. Of course, uh, initially the bike speed always goes. <laughs> First. Are you saying the bike is faster than the yeah, horse? Yeah, technically the bike technically. is actually faster than the horse. It, it, technically. It, 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 technically, yeah. yeah. yeah because yeah. It's, yeah. It's, it's, it's a machine versus, yeah. a, versus a live animal. But in the but, long run, uh, I don't know, it can. Yeah. But how we controlled is, yeah, because he's a great horse rider and I'm a, I can he, ride my bike. A lot of people associate him with bikes and a lot of people associate me. I'm also a bike lover. Oh, no. I started riding bike when I was. Don't get onto on his bike. <laughs> so, I don't have. Bike. Better. I don't have any. It's better. Bikes don't now. sit behind. A bike. That's why I can't ride it. Ah, don't ride and don't sit behind him. Also, you will never sit on a bike. I would love to. You will never sit on a bike again. <laughs> we will. I think you should experience your <laughs> ride. Um, I'm a huge fan of Ali, but like, if you ask me oh. who's my favorite actress, I would say her name. Like, ever since I watched Highway, I know uh, she's a versatile actor, and she's been. She's been crazy with her acting skills. Uh, what did she bring to the table when she uh, came to the sets of RRR? Uh, exactly what she's supposed to uh, do, uh, like we were discussing uh, earlier. She has to look fragile, but she should have the inner strength to, to be able to bring these two super powers of fire and water together yes. and uh, not let them destroy each other. That is what her role in the film is. And that's what exactly she, she did. Terrific performer. I love her. Uh, I love her from uh, Razi. On uh, uh, a, 1 to uh, 10, how much would you give her as an actor? As an actor? Uh, 9.5, 9.8. Uh, for Tara? 
Tarak is 10. 10? Uh, for Ram? Same. 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 Ten. Uh, there is this uh, holding hands. Uh, it has actually become very popular. Um, so what does it symbolize? I, I know it's friendship and how, what did you choose? Why did you choose this as the... Yeah, basically uh, Charan symbolizes uh, fire and uh, Tarak symbolizes water and uh, the lyric it's the starting of the song uh, Dosti. Yeah. So basically if the fire and water are coming together one will destroy the other. Yeah. If the fire is stronger it will evaporate the water. Mm -hmm. If the water is strong it will put out the fire. So what's going to happen? How do they become friends? Yeah. How, do, how, do, how does they have become friends? How does what does the friendship is is going to give them. Yes. Is it going to destroy them? And who is going to destroy Who is going to dis get destroyed? <laughs> so, uh, that's a beautiful message too. Um, I want to ask, uh, when you release a movie, Pan India, obviously you need to work with a lot of people hand in hand to make sure the movie releases smoothly, yet with a bang. Like, f first day everybody has it. It has to be <laughs> houseful, right? So, people need to know when it is releasing. You have to literally hammer it into their head. So, from Kerala, uh, I heard that you created a huge bus in uh, bus as in B U Z Z uh, in Trivandrum when you all came. <laughs> there was a huge crowd. Even a fan uh, came running, and there's a lot of stories I've heard. Um, so, what do you have to say about Kerala market, and who is helping you with the uh, with the promotions and everything, and how is it going there? Yeah, it's been fantastic across the country. It has been fantastic, and uh, uh, Kerala is a, a bit special because. Many of our holidays will be in Kerala. <laughs> Many of our film shootings will be in uh, uh, in Kerala, and uh, Kerala is an evolved audience, uh, and we uh, we make kind of uh, nice masala movies. So getting a a certificate from the Kerala audience is like okay, we reach to all kinds of audiences. So Kerala is uh, is definitely special, special and uh, special and. When we go there for a uh, film uh, event and we see the kind of crowd that is coming and we see the kind of uh, uh, buzz that buzz, is, that's, yeah. that's happening, so it makes us super happy. Okay, okay. we got one, one tick in the box. And uh, uh, I have been meeting Shibu uh, sir for a, a long time. Uh, he's a close friend of my father, even though their ages are quite different. <laughs> he's my uh, close friend. We met many times. At the time of the promotion, I didn't know Shubhu sir was yeah, yeah, is associated with my uh, with my film. Okay, you didn't. You know, know. I was completely busy with doing uh, something, and suddenly I ran into him, and I said, "Ah, Shubhu sir, what are you doing in Hyderabad?" And he said, "I came to here to buy buy the movie." And I, it didn't even stuck me then that he came to buy RRR. <laughs> RRR. <laughs> RRR. <laughs> then after after a while it struck me and I was so happy to get associated with him because he's one of the, the best. kind of passion he has yes. the, for the film. That's the kind of people you'd like to associate. Uh, with. Definitely, definitely. And what about you uh, both? Uh, how do you see Kerala? What do you, uh, what do you love absolutely. so much about Kerala? We all uh, adore your films and your actors. The amount of... Uh, Could you mention a film that you really like recently? Uh, uh, Huh? Anything. Minal Murli. Minal uh, Murli, of Murli, course. Of course it, it uh, and then, yeah. of course, I like all Lal Sir's films I've been following. Prithvi Sir's uh, direction, directorial films. Yes. I uh, love Lucifer, which my dad is doing here. And yeah. uh, we are huge fans of your film. And your audience have evolved so much yeah. with such great films. It is very important, like Raj Mali Sir said, uh, for us to come there and get that validation from them. And that was one of the few city promotions which I I was a little scared to come and see the acceptance and see how they will accept us. And thanks to Shibu sir and his production and team, they've done a fantastic job. You visualize a lot before the film happens and during the film. Does your visualization end when the movie finishes or do you continue to visualize even after? Like, do you visualize the success of the film? Like, all three of you? Of course, I'm not, I'll not be a human being if I don't dream about the success of the films. But I, I try to not, not get into that uh, uh, space because I have so much of job on hand to, uh, hand to do. Surprisingly for me, once I, I tell the scene very nicely, I, I, I tell, I, I'm a good orator when it comes to the storytelling. But once it comes onto the screen, once I capture capture it, I lose it. I can't tell the scene again. Uh, that's a surprising quality that <laughs> that I have. I think all three of you are extremely lucky because we are such a huge industry. 
uh, if anybody wants to be an engineer or a doctor, they can learn, just become. But when it comes to an actor or a director, it's not that easy. You have to really prove yourself to reach there. There are thousands and lakhs of people who want to be actors. They've literally lived their whole life wanting to be sitting in their, that seat is what they dream of. Uh, and as a director, like, a lot of people dream about being on that other side. What do you have to tell those people? Don't stop dreaming. Sorry? Don't, Don't stop. stop dreaming. Don't stop dreaming. I, I always keep dreaming, keep working for it. I always said in the past, this is the, probably the only industry which is non corrupt. You can pay off somebody and get a medical seat. You can pay off somebody and get a job. You can pay off somebody and become a minister or an MLA. But you cannot pay off somebody and become a great actor or a great director. This is the only industry that based on talent. And These people uh, are the Yeah, job. we are really fortunate and lucky to be quite successful or and sustaining in this industry sustainer. for a while. That's Keep a chasing your dream, right? Yeah. Just yeah. I heard that he's a great singer. Very good singer. I want oh, to. No. Yeah. Please, this, just for the promo, please. I'm not a great singer. <laughs> and that Nadu, but Nadu, Nadu step also. I can only sing. So I, I should uh, give a case against that page. Because they said 10 facts you didn't know about Tarak. So, uh, in one of uh, main facts, I didn't know. But I knew because of that page. Is, uh, he's that a good sings. teacher, he's a good singer. He'll teach you the step Nadu. Nadu. No, I'll no. sing with you. Please. See, I have, I have, as I said, you know, earlier I would do it, but now, I'm not going to sing in interviews or dance in interviews. Right? I'll probably I'll, I'll probably sing and dance with you once hour, you know once after we release the film and we come to Kerala, right? So then we'll sing and dance there. Yeah. In celebration.